Guys, please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, especially if you're a UFC fan. As we all know, Leon Edwards knocked out Kamaru Usman in their rematch, um, in which Kamaru was dominating. And now I'm here to tell you what he needs to do to get his title back. Okay, as we all know, I also have already done a third fight prediction. I didn't pick Kamaru. But if he were to win the fight, this is how he needs to do it. But first and foremost, y'all can't say he was overconfident or anything like that. Like I said in my recent short, I think Leon just, it was his night. And he caught Kamaru while Kamaru thought he had done enough to pull away. And he felt like Leon was just tired. It's not because he thought Leon was a lesser fighter or didn't belong in there or anything like that. And you can't say that. So, yeah. But... Um, if he wins this fight, he needs to do a little less striking and a little more wrestling. What do I mean by that? Well, um, the striking actually was pretty good. I think, um, he needs to do the opposite from what he did, which was half of the fight, which was giving Leon distance to throw leg kicks and body shots and that, obviously, that big head kick and the jabs that Leon was throwing in the fight, which he did have success with. Uh, he needs to do more of, um, what I thought Leon should have done in the first, I mean, not first fight, the second fight, which is clenching. I think he should clench him. Clearly, he's stronger in the clinch than Leon is. He can pull him into the clinch, hit him with those uppercuts, and be okay if he doesn't get a knockout. Le uh, for Kamaru to win this fight, this needs to be he needs to be okay with it being a boring fight. You know, he's clearly the better grappler. Now, as far as being that much better, I don't know about that. You know, um, I think the altitude was a big factor because both Cormier and Rogan were saying that um. Um, something about Leon had never fought or trained in this altitude before, and it was pretty clearly an effect on him. Not just him, but if you look at the Luke Rockhold fight, Luke Rockhold never gets tired like that, you know. Not to make excuses, but I don't, I, I don't doubt that Kamara's a better wrestler, grappler than him. I just don't think he's that much better. That's what I'm saying. But, um, for Kamaru, he needs to wrestle a little bit more. I think he needs to be able to take him down and accept the fact he's probably not going to take him down as many times because now Leon's going to be better prepared to at least slow it down. Um, he needs to be okay with doing what he did with Masvidal in the first fight, putting Leon against the cage. He's clearly stronger than him. Make Leon carry his weight. Uppercuts, maybe some body shots. Mix it up a little bit more than just the uppercuts because that's what he was hitting Leon with most of the time on the feet anyway. Um... And just wear him down and then pull away the right way. What do I mean by that? Don't give Leon distance and you leave yourself open to getting hit with a big knee or a big kick in this case. Uh, I think if Kamaru can do that for five rounds, he should win the title back. And he should end up winning a 49-46 decision victory. Um, again, he doesn't need to give Leon space. He doesn't need to let Leon clinch him and sweep him up with the legs. If he clenches him, he needs to put him against the cage and grind on him with knee strikes like he d was doing most of the fight with the uppercuts, with the big shots. Not big shots, but, you know, enough to score some points and get Leon's attention. And then, um, okay, uppercut, uppercut, shoot, shoot for the takedown, you know, get the takedown, you know. If he can do that, get about... Four, at least, he doesn't even need as many takedowns he did in the second fight. If he can get at least three or four solid takedowns and control the place and the pace of the stand-up, you get what I mean? Because I still don't think he's a better striker than Leon. But I think if he controls the positioning of the stand-up, like putting Leon against the cage and can take the fight to the ground multiple times, it should be a, a pretty big win for him. That's all he has to do. You know, that's it. Can he follow through with that? We'll see.